Hello, Diana Teeters here. I'm in Adobe Premiere Pro and today I'm going to show you a really fun wedding video intro. Let's see. Okay, these clips can be found on Wedding Essentials Volume 2 HD or Wedding Essentials Volume 5. So let me start by taking all of this out of the timeline and building this from scratch. Now the clips that I have are Retro Hearts Background 1. I've created three titles, one with the wedding day date, one with the bride and groom groom's name and then simply one that says wedding day. So we'll start by dragging the retro hearts background into video track one and we will put a cross dissolve at the beginning. We'll drag the date title down just past that and we'll cross dissolve it at the beginning. Now the key to making this work is to have the title zoom off the screen as the heart zooming off. And we can do that by using a video transition in the zoom folder called cross zoom. Let's drag that to the title, the end of the title. And you can see that it's a little bit behind. So let's, let's trim that clip a little bit and now the title and the heart are zooming this little hair there are zooming out at the same time now we will put the next title in as soon as that heart animation stops so let's put the name this is Bonnie and Clyde and we'll put a cross dissolve at the beginning And again, we'll pay attention to the timing of the heart leaving and zooming off the screen because that's what we're going to want to do with, with the transition. So let's go get that cross zoom transition and drag it to the end of this title. And we want to time that out. Shorten that just a hair. So they kind of leave the screen at the same time. Okay, then finally, we'll wait till the next heart comes in and we'll drag the wedding day title there. We'll put a cross dissolve at the beginning and we will also do a cross zoom as that heart leaves. Now we're going to end this with a dip to black. So that's also a transition found in the dissolve and here it is we'll drag that to the end of this clip so that as soon as that zooms out we'll dip to black. Now the soundtrack that I used is called Ride of the Valkyries and it can be found on the Fresh Music Authentic Classical CD. So let's go ahead and drag that to audio track one and we'll trim it back to the end here and let's make some uh, some volume keyframes for this audio track. I'm going to set the scrubber right here. I'm going to have it start right as the start of the dip to black transition. And if you click here, you can add a keyframe to the audio. And I'll go to the end of the clip and add another keyframe. And then I'll get that out of the way. Then you come down here and you drag this keyframe down and that will fade the music and it'll sound like this. Well there you have it. Thanks for watching and happy editing. 